It is a decades-old tradition, the Hampton Beach Seafood Festival, but will the recent outbreak of Legionnaire's disease impact this year's event? Fifteen people have been diagnosed with the flu pneumonia-like illness. And one person actually died from the disease. Katie Brace is in Hampton Beach tonight, where she says many festival goers aren't too worried about the outbreak. Awesome! <laughs> Beach days may be over, but visitors packed Hampton Beach's main drag for everything seafood. Yeah. Yeah. The annual Hampton Beach Seafood Festival draws patrons who spend the entire weekend. Every year we come here from Connecticut. That's good news for restaurants like Ray's, who were concerned this year they would take a hit due to the Legionnaires outbreak. We were, but talking, you know, to, to everyone else, it seems like that it's been contained. The festival is just feet away from two hotels that were recently linked to a Legionnaires disease outbreak. One of them is right there. The state health department closed hot tubs at the Sands Resort and the Harris Sea Ranch Motel. The outbreak sickened 15 people and one person died from the form of bacterial pneumonia. Did it make you a little apprehensive? No, because I drink bottled water everywhere I go. <laughs> Certified so nurse Vanessa concerned. Gray was no. told about the outbreak hours before she arrived and says it's concerning. That's something that shouldn't be happening. Legionnaires is spread through hot tubs, air conditioners, and misters. Not everyone who comes into contact with the bacteria becomes sick. The health risk, yeah, I mean, the chances of getting it are very slim, so. Just don't go in a hot tub. Everything else we can enjoy. Enjoying everything fresh, fried, and boiled. In Hampton Beach, Katie Brace, WBZ News.